Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. This is Mike Del Coro, Florida Paranormal Researcher. And uh, we just got back from Savannah. I went with Joe, a uh, good buddy of mine, also a teammate from uh, War Party Paranormal. And we went and checked out a couple different locations. This video here is going to be on the Surreal Weed House. Um, I'll give you a quick little rundown, uh, Mike style, of the uh, history. But there's obviously a lot more to it. Um, so you could check that out online or, or look it up there. I'm sure there's a lot of, a lot of history, uh, about this location, uh, readily available, but basically make a long story short, uh, 1700s rich family lived there. Uh, they had a bunch of slaves that worked for them, enslaved people, if you will. And the husband or the, uh, the owner of the house. Uh, got caught next door with the care in the carriage house with one of his favorite slaves, Molly. Um, that didn't go over so well. The wife found out they had a big argument. Just one thing led to another. She fell out the window, broke her neck, died. Um, he said it was an accident. She fainted. And that was that. And he never got in trouble. And he didn't get in trouble for the Molly thing either, because back then, um, enslaved person was property. So he was allowed to do whatever he wanted. Pretty sick stuff. So he got away with it. And then uh, after a while, there's uh, a lot of reports of many different things in this home. Um, shadow figures. There's... Um, one time the basement was used for the, the owner's brother to put together a makeshift operating, um, uh, room and he was doing amputations and he lost like half his patients. Um, so there's a lot of death involved in this building, a lot of trauma and different things. So without further, further ado, uh, let's get into it and give you guys what you came here for and see what evidence we captured. Um, real quick, before I go into that, I wanna throw this out there. Same old thing, right? Like, subscribe, hit the uh, notification bell, and you'll be alerted when I post new content. Um, and it really does help. I know everybody says it, but it really does help. If you hit the like, and you share it, and you comment, it, uh, it gets it up in front of more people so i get more of my content out there in the end it, it helps me so would really appreciate that and also to view some other uh great videos and some really amazing stuff click right here and that'll link you over to the other stuff and again appreciate it let's do it to your space. We do not mean any disrespect to you. We come with love and light and we only wish to communicate you, with you and to share your story. We invite you to come to us, speak to us, and communicate with us. We do have some devices that you will be able to interact with. We'll show you how to use them. We just wanted to say thank you very much for allowing us into your space. Hey, how you doing? My name is Mike. I got my friend Joe here. We got a couple other friends here. Um, I got this little device down here. I'm sure you guys have seen it. It's a recorder. This is my first time here. I'm going to set it down on this table. If there's anything that you want to tell us right off the bat, if you want to come over here and just speak into this recorder that I'm setting down on the table. Um, I'm 
to this thing. Go for it. Tell me where you want to go. All right, so my friend Joe here can sense that you're here. Can you tell us what your name is? All right, so my friend Joe here can sense that you're here. Can you tell us what your name is? Okay. Put down that one. No, with your eyes. walking over at the end of this hall and a lot of people have reported that you're walking through here. Are you protecting something or someone? I walked into this room and I felt some pressure on my head. I just want to know if that was you that was coming to try to communicate with me. Can you please respond to any of these boxes in my hand? You see that? Yep. To me. Are you here? Then it came from that way down the stairs to me. Who's here? Did you just walk to me?
Shut your mouth. Oh my God. So, you don't need to scream at me. I can hear you just fine if you talk very lightly into this recorder that I set down on this desk. Who's here with me right now? How about this? To do me a favor and prove that I'm communicating with somebody intelligent or intelligent being, what color is this light that I have on my chest? Okay, it seems like you're starting to open up and communicate with me a little bit. I really appreciate that. Thank you. You want to hear something? Yes. You don't have to get that close. Shut your mouth. Oh, my God. Oh, shit. I just started getting them to talk to me. That's what I've been trying to do all night. Thank you.